Hey everybody, welcome back to Inmatis Ghosts of Maple Creek. Now, I had a little goof up when I recorded, so I had to re-record this part, which meant playing the entire game all over again. Because I had an audio glitch. Which means... meant, well, when I recorded the video, the audio didn't record, so... And since this game isn't like you just pull up a save file and there you go, you have to start pretty much all over again, so I probably had extra, so telling I beat the game, but I had to re-beat the game. Now to recap, you're at the gas station now, and Kate's boyfriend has still not showed up. So, I do let's check out the country lane, the crypt, and the secret chamber, so. Let's head back over to the church first. So we have some things to do before Keith's before we reunite with everybody, so oh, wait, country lane you only have to get one thing, so let's go and quickly do that. Use your knife and <laughs> Okay, that's all you need that okay, you don't have rubber coming back this way. Now look at this, we're still missing the one runic code. At least the part of it. Okay, now we're going back up to the crypt. Sorry, I kinda went side my thought process went sideways for a second. Still missing those wedges, so let's go this way first. Can't do anything here, okay? And he'll just hang it up there in the church for the rest of the game. <laughs> okay, that word I am this room is that I right there. It's pretty much what they use to sprinkle holy water on people in church. And I can see where no one's not going to really understand how to do that one. Well, how to figure that one out. Okay, four more wedges to find. Okay, remember these two crates we couldn't open before? Take your handy dandy axe and just... Give them a couple of wax each. Okay, one more grass wedge to find, then we'll get back to that one. Alright, this is an object puzzle before we get that far. Yeah, that symbol is the symbol for Omega. There's the symbol for Venus. Mm. Ah, right, the nice helmet. Brass wedge. Okay, we have all the brass wedges now. Hmm. I need five. Four more parts of that. Okay, this one is going to take you a few tries because it took me a few tries. Remember that name on that ritual sheet, which I'm right here. Asthma die. That's what you have to spell out on that dial. Now, 
Not as easy as it sounds. It takes me a few tries, I think, to uh, do this, because I cannot... Just be, be aware of which way you're turning down, so you know which way you're spelling this out. I am mentally counting to myself how to do this. Because you have to somehow get back up to the A. It's like getting up to that part is easy. Once you get to try to get to that A, it's like you're Don't screw this up. Okay, you get the solution. I just hit the wrong number. Shows puzzles, even I don't get some puzzles right on the first first go. This last one and it's three, not two. I hit two on accident, so there you go. I'll hit the lever and then hey, wait no, is our last bit of runic code. That sequence is important. I can show you how you kind of screw it up just because and only that our whole evidence board is complete. Now we go back to the gas station. Because it's maybe hopefully at this point someone is there waiting for us. Take the car, Kate, and drive the two of you away from Maple Creek as fast as you can. Don't stop until you reach the city. Then pull over and find a phone. Call the police and tell them who you are. Won't you come with us, Detective? There's a serial killer on the loose here. I can't let him escape. Tell the police I said to send reinforcements pronto. Thank you, Detective. You've saved our lives. Detective, I found this in the church. I thought you might need it. Good luck. <laughs> Pretty sure I know what this is for. Just need to find the rest of them. The church, the chapel, or the boathouse by the lake. They must be hidden somewhere there. Well, since you now have only three of the five pieces, you're just looking for two pieces. Probably the best place to look for is the chapel, which does not seem to be the case. Now, this could be the one part that's random where you're gonna find them. Like which locations will open up to, for you to find them. There you go. There you go. Hmm. 
They say Narcissus is a type of flower. <sighs> you know, as you sometimes you get to the end, it's you think it'd be easier, sometimes it's not and what you're trying to look for. How subtle they made it. And be much what they call a candle sniffer is pretty much a device you use just to extinguish a candle from that's centimeters and taller than you. Other and uh, two more music notes. As I said before, they're staring you right in the face and you just can't think of it. You have to give it a minute for it to recharge. Ugh. Like I said, subtlety. And there's the, my last item. This one. Okay, so it looks like we're just missing one more piece. This should be our last puzzle that we have to do. As you can see, I am making very short work of this because I pretty much kind of just did this one. Like I said, I had to do a redo. Okay, we have all five pieces, and all thing left to do now is head back to the boathouse. <laughs> Up to the rocks, and well, here's your scraper. Let's see where everything goes. Now, remember the runic code, you gotta put everything in a certain order. Just trying to see if I can remember from memory what it is. <laughs> I say you need to go back into the evidence and look at the code. Just remember. <laughs> Hey, uh, it took me two tries. <laughs> Use your rope ladder so you can get my way down. It's pretty dark in here. I can't see a thing. I remember now. Well. You've gone too far, Detective. You want to know what happened to them? Looks like you learned the hard way.
smarter than I thought. A great pity for us both. My bell, you silenced it before I could drain my puppets and fully revive. My congratulations. I'm helpless. Is it true? Did you murder all those women? Why? Who are you? I did. But the who and why are of no consequence to you. You'd neither believe nor understand. It doesn't matter. You'll do no harm to anyone anymore. What's behind that door? You know perfectly well, detective. But why not indulge your curiosity? have been lost on this altar of evil. I'll do whatever it takes to destroy it, if that means no one else is murdered here. Thank you, detective. I knew you could solve it. Now, it's high time. I close this case. I've been waiting for this moment for 30 years. Wait. I know who you are and what he has done. But he must be brought to trial. No. You have no idea who he is. What he is. He must be stopped. Once and for all. I'll kill him right here, right now. He'll suffer the same fate as his victims. Then you'll be no better than him! Think of Emily. Is this what she would have you do? Don't you dare speak her name. You can't stop me, detective. Well... Yeah, use the pickaxe to break the chain. I was wondering when he was going to show back up again. Take the chain and, well, wrap it around the statue's neck. What are you doing? There will be no more murders here. Detective, are you alright? We set out as soon as we got the call. Detective, you're not looking so good. What on earth happened here? I need to debrief you as soon as possible. Detective? Can you hear me? You've done well, Detectives. Kate Burroughs is here, safe in our custody. Her boyfriend is recovering at the hospital. And Maple Creek is finally at peace. However, we could find neither hide nor hair of the criminal. And Hamilton disappeared into thin air, too. Thank you again, Detective. I owe my life to you, but I'm afraid I'll never feel safe with the killer still on the loose. Trust me, Kate. He may have gone into hiding, but I haven't stopped hunting him. I never will. Continued. Well, folks, this is the end of this run of Ignaz, the ghost of, of Maple Creek. Now, if I've been saying the, but the title part wrong, please let me know. It's not one of those easy words to say. <laughs> um, well, the next episode is going to be the bonus chapter of the game. And I certainly have fun with this game. I'm hoping uh, you guys have fun watching me do this. And thanks to Artif Artifacts Mundi for making these games because they are a, a lot of fun. And they have several games out. So we'll, we'll see you in the next. And we can't unlock the extras until we get the bonus part done. So I'll see you in the next one. Bye.